from mind-blowing skyscrapers that touch the clouds to enormous dams that harness the power of nature, and even the jaw-dropping feat of relocating entire capital city ESA 2022 is witnessing some truly unbelievable mega-projects taking shape, and if that's not enough, picture this, man-made islands emerging from the sea adding a whole new dimension to our world. Let's dive into the excitement of these amazing constructions. Imagine this, Egypt is crafting a brand new capital right in the heart of the desert, just 50 kilometers east of Cairo. Why, you ask? Well, Cairo, the current capital, is bursting at the seams with over 20 million folks, and guess what? By 2050, that number is expected to double. Talk about a city feeling the squeeze. So, Enter the stage left, the new capital. This shiny, unnamed gem is set to be a game changer. It's not just about giving the government a swanky new headquarters, it's about creating a fresh start for 6 million lucky people. Picture this lush green spaces twice the size of New York's Central Park and a skyline graced by Africa's tallest skyscraper, the iconic tower. The first phase is already in motion, with ministries, government buildings, and nature's retreats taking shape, with a whopping budget of $40 billion. This is no small feat and it's one of the priciest mega-projects of 2022. And, oh boy, the buzz is real as government offices have started making the leap to their new desert digs. Buckle up, folks in Egypt's got big plans, and they're making it happen right now. China's got a power move in the works, with a whopping 1.4 billion people to cater to. They're facing the challenge of meeting the ever-growing hunger for energy, and how are they tackling it? Well, they're going big, really big. Enter the Bayhatendama hydroelectric powerhouse that's set to become the world's second largest dam by 2022. Picture this, it's like the Three Gorges Dam, but even more colossal. This mammoth dam packs a punch with an electric power capacity of a staggering 16,000 megawatts at almost eight times the might of the Hoover Dam in the USA. Now, here's the kicker, this $34 billion project is no pipe dream. It's already flexing its muscles with partial operations kicking off in April 2021. By June, it was already buzzing with electricity, thanks to two out of its 16 turbines doing their thing. And the grand finale? The dam is gearing up to be fully operational by July 2022. China's not just thinking big they're making it happen, one turbine at a time. FY apostrophe superscript a ethios a s inverted exclamation mark, big news for the Big Apple. New York's JFK Airport, already a global hub, is getting a jaw-dropping makeover starting in 2022. And guess what? It's not just a touch-up we're talking about a whopping $9.5 billion glow-up at the largest private investment ever seen for an airport project. Hold on to your hats because this transformation aims to catapult JFK into the ranks of the world's most sought-after airport destinations. The star of the show, a brand new Terminal 1, waving goodbye to the old Terminal 1, the ancient 59-year-old Terminal 2, and the already demolished Terminal 3. Now, picture this, larger-than-life check-ins, sleek modern architecture and exhibits showcasing iconic New York landmarks. It's not just a renovation it's a revolution in airport vibes. But here's the kicker, this isn't a quick fix. Construction on the spanking new Terminal 1 is set to groove through the decade. However, the first of its 23 shining new gates will be ready to roll by 2026. Get ready, world of New York's JFK is turning heads, one gate at a time. Thy. One half AOI diaresis sedilla thy one fourth. Let's talk soccer sensation. The Chinese Super League rocked the football world, luring global icons like Carlos Tevez, Oscar, and Hulk with mega contracts. And who's the financial wizard behind this game changing move? Enter the Evergrande Real Estate Group, with a property empire spanning 300 locations in 280 Chinese cities. But here's the blockbuster move. Evergrande aimed to construct the grandest soccer arena ever the Guangzhou era Grand Football Stadium. Think 100,000 seats, eclipsing even Barcelona's camp. The game plan? Finish building this colossal spectacle by the end of 2022. Hold on, though. Plot twist. Evergrande hit a financial snag in 2020, slamming the brakes on all their mega-projects, 
including the stadium dream. Fast forward to December, their financial storm hit a peak as they missed a crucial repayment, making Evergrande the world's most indebted company with a jaw-dropping $300 billion in liabilities. Now, cue the suspenseful moment. Chinese authorities stepped in, taking control of the stadium project. And guess what? They put it up for auction. If no takers emerge, a state-owned group might swoop in. But, given Evergrande's history, the burning question is, will they pull the plug on this colossal stadium dream? The soccer world is on the edge of its seat, waiting for the final whistle on this mega-project saga. As one half Thyy Idiris Sadilla Thy Sadilla, in 2016, Saudi Arabian unveiled a game-changing initiative called Saudi Vision 2030, aiming to shift away from oil dependency and embrace economic diversification through tourism and investments. A crucial piece of this vision is the $20 billion Jeddah Economic City, and guess what? It's well on its way to becoming a reality. Picture this, roads and landscaping work are nearly done setting the stage for the city's three vibrant districts. But that's not how Ajeda Economic City is eyeing the title of hosting the world's tallest skyscraper, the Jeddah Tower. While the tower's destiny remains uncertain, the city has plans for more than 200 other towering structures. Once the foundational work is complete, get ready for a skyline transformation, as new skyscrapers rise, marking the grandeur of Saudi Arabia's most significant mega-project. Thio thy one fourth Thyi Diarisis Sadilla. Bangladesh, with its numerous rivers and low lying land, faces significant challenges like frequent flooding and the impacts of climate change. These hurdles make building modern infrastructure both difficult and costly, hampering the country's economic growth. Enter the Padma Bridge Mega Projecta, an economic lifeline set to connect the capital, Dhaka with the southern regions. Originally funded by the World Bank and other donors at a cost of $3 billion, the project hit a snag when corruption allegations surfaced against Bangladeshi officials. The World Bank withdrew its support, cancelling a credit of $1.2 billion. Other donors followed suit, despite the corruption cases being dismissed in a Canadian court, Bangladesh decided to press on financing the project with its own funds. Construction on this two-level marvel began in 2014. The upper level hosts a four-lane highway, while the lower level accommodates a single-track railway. Imagine this, the 6.1-kilometer-long bridge stands on 42 pillars, reaching a depth of up to 122 meters in the water. By June 2022, this engineering feat will open to the public becoming Bangladesh's longest bridge and one of the world's lengthiest river crossings. The Padma Bridge is more than just a structure it's a game-changer. Anticipated to handle 75,000 vehicles daily, it will slash travel time and operating costs. Beyond the immediate benefits, it's expected to boost Bangladesh's GDP by up to 2%, signaling a brighter economic future for the nation. Thy OF, thy one-fourth. The Philippines has a smart plan up its sleeve. With Manila perched on the unpredictable Pacific Ring of Fire, a region known for intense seismic activity and active volcano acid, the need for a backup capital is apparent. Enter New Clark City, strategically located around 100 kilometers north of Manila. Imagine a city larger than Manhattan, and you've got New Clark City. This mega project is not just a contingency plan, it's a visionary move. Designed to accommodate potential challenges in the capital, it will feature new government facilities, special economic zones, and homes for up to 1.2 million residents. This city of the future will unfold in five phases over 30 years, with the first phase set to wrap up in 2022. By choosing a central and safer location, the Philippines is ensuring a robust and resilient future. New Clark City isn't just a backup, it's a blueprint for sustainable growth and a haven for those seeking a safer, more secure home. Thio Thy inverted exclamation mark Ethio, Switzerland's success with the Gothard Base Tunnel in 2016, enabling swift cargo transport across Europe is about to be duplicated in the form of the Brenner Base Tunnel a game-changer spanning 55 kilometers and connecting Italy and Austria. This mega-project, set to become the world's second-longest railway tunnel, has earned high-priority status from the European Union, 
contributing half of the estimated costs. The excavation journey began in 2014, with an initial completion date set for 2025. However, technical challenges during tunneling caused a three-year delay. In 2020, a billion-dollar contract termination with a key developer led to a reissuance of construction tenders, pushing the overall delay to four years. Despite the hurdles, the Brenner Base Tunnel is projected to be fully operational by 2032, with an estimated cost of around $9 billion. As of 2022, excavation work on the Italian side is complete, and progress continues near the Austrian border. Once operational, the tunnel promises a remarkable reduction in travel times from 80 to just 25 minutes, simultaneously alleviating road congestion by redirecting heavy load traffic to this subterranean railway line. The Brenner Base Tunnel is not just about cutting through mountains it's about forging a more efficient and sustainable future in European transport. Ethio Ethy Currency I Diaris Sadilla, Ho Chi Minh City, home to about 9 million people, boasts Vietnam's largest metropolitan area, their main airport, despite having a capacity for 25 million passengers, served over 35 million in 2019 causing some serious congestion. While the COVID-19 pandemic provided a temporary relief, Vietnam is gearing up for a long-term solution. Enter the new Long Than International Airport, approved by the government in January 2021. Situated 40 kilometers east of Ho Chi Minh City, this airport is said to be a game-changer. Imagine this, three phases of construction, eventually catering to a whopping 100 million passengers every year. Now. Here's the twist. Vietnam, still dealing with the aftermath of the Vietnam War, had about 18% of its land contaminated with mines, one of the highest figures globally. By 2021, the mine detection and clearance work were completed, and construction was set to kick off. Fast forward to today, and here's the exciting news of the first phase is set to be completed six months ahead of schedule. That means the airport will be handling 25 million passengers annually sooner than expected. In the second phase, the Airports Corporation of Vietnam will add a second runway and expand the passenger terminal, boosting capacity to 50 million passengers. Hold on to your hats because this ambitious three-phase project comes with a hefty price tag of $16 billion, making it Vietnam's most expensive infrastructure project in history. Get ready to witness the future of air travel in Vietnam take flight. Thy Ethio Thy Degrees, Denmark, a trailblazer in offshore wind energy since constructing the world's first offshore wind farm in 1991, is set to redefine sustainable energy production. The country is embarking on a groundbreaking project of the construction of an artificial energy island in the middle of the North Sea. This visionary endeavor involves creating a centralized power plant surrounded by windmills strategically positioned to meet Denmark's growing demand for sustainable energy. Before construction begins, meticulous geological surveys are underway to ensure the seabed's suitability for laying foundations. This includes seabed sampling and mapping the geological layers below the seafloor to a depth of 100 meters. Building this artificial island is no small feat, requiring the delivery of a staggering 4 million tons of soil to the North Sea. Picture these the turbines involved will be colossal, some towering up to three times the size of the Statue of Liberty. The estimated outcome, a site that produces 50% more energy than Denmark requires, with surplus energy exported to neighboring countries. This ambitious $34 billion project marks the largest construction effort in Denmark's history. If successful, Denmark plans to replicate its efforts in the Baltic Sea solidifying its position as a global leader in sustainable energy innovation. Now, which mega project are you most excited about in 2022? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and if you're eager for more insights into colossal projects, check out our video on the biggest mega project world records. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next video.